how's everybody doing? I am surprising y'all with a quick little check-in before I um start my shift. I know y'all have been wondering where have I been, what have I been up to, why haven't I been live, and I've been tired. I worked the night shift and I've been like super duper uber sleepy. So, um, I decided to check in real quick while I'm sitting and waiting around. Um, so what's new? Let me tell y'all what was going on with my, my new shift or whatever. Um, so, started this job probably like two weeks ago, almost. Um, and I'm driving local, so I'm home every day. And... What else? Um, I get here, I get to work around 9.30. What's up, Proud Felon? I get to work around 9.30 at night. I drive my full clock until, well, not my full clock, I try. It, it ends up being that way because, um, I, I'll explain it. So I get here around 9.30 at night and I'll check in, get my work, and um, go on my run, my run, right? And that lasts until about, thank you, Alan. Um, that lasts about until, I would say, um, I'll probably run until about 5.30 in the morning, six o'clock. And then I head back. I was doing short runs at first. And so you'll do like a short run. And then you'll come back and you're supposed to get another trailer. What up, Rodney? What up, Trey? But I haven't been able to adjust to the schedule. So I haven't had enough, enough energy to come back to get another, another um, load to take out. Because I've been getting back around 7 a.m. And I'm not, I'm not at night. <laughs> So I will get back around 7 a.m. and I will be super tired and I'll go straight home and go to sleep and sleep all day until the next night. What up, Leandria? So that was my schedule. I was taking short runs. They want, if, in order to make money here, you want to take like two, you want to take, one load is like three stops. You want to have at least six stops a day. I'm not, I, I haven't had the energy to do six stops a day. So, um, I've been taking long loads. Long loads is where I'll, um, I will get my, I'll come around 9.30 and it, I'll drive for like three hours till, uh, until I get to my first stop and then do my stops and then come back. For me, that's easier. It was hard for me to, um, it was hard for me to drive like an hour and a half and then stop and another 30 minutes and stop another hour and stop. I'm, I'm an OTR driver, right? So I'm used to, I'm trying to get this. I'm used to driving. Um, I've trained my body when I'm tired that I can just drive. I, I'm, I'm used to driving. It felt like it was more tiresome or more, um, what's what I'm looking for? I don't know how to explain, I just know driving a short route, like driving for an hour and a half or two hours and then stopping and doing work and then driving again and stopping and doing work make me more tired versus driving three to four hours and then stopping. I, I do better when I'm driving long distance. So um, that's what I'm doing now. And basically, like I said, I get here at 9.30, sometimes nine, sometimes 10. They don't really care. <laughs> I, as long as I'm here between 9.30 and midnight, um, I don't like to get to here too late because then I'll leave late and I don't want to be leaving so late. Um, so if I did a short run, I'll probably get back around 7 and have to take another load out. So the loads, the runs usually last like 7 hours, right? So if I, if I got here at 9.30, I, start, I left at like 11, right? What up, Cynthia? What up, Brandon? What up, Day Day? What up, James? If I got here and left around 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 
I'll be doing my last load around 5, 6 o'clock in the morning. I'll get here around 7.30. I'll have to take another load. And if I got here around 7.30, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, that's 1 o'clock p.m. I'll be done getting back here again. And I, I just can't see myself doing that. What up, Frankie? Um, so I figure if I take long loads, really long loads, then I'll be able to um, get the miles and get the pay that I need to get and then try to adjust that to my schedule. Um, I haven't had time to go home and like cook or you know be with my kids because when I get home I get home between 8 a.m. and 10 a.m. and I sleep until 8 or 9 o'clock at night and then I do it all over again. So that's how that's going. Um, I haven't had a chance to study. I haven't had a chance to do anything. I'm just really trying to adjust and find my footing here. Um, what else? I like it. I like it. I like it here. I can, I can see myself doing this for the long run until I actually go to law school. Um, I just got to find a way to... What up, Brandon? I just have to find a way to just... Thank you, Jamos. I did this video because of you. Thank you for that message you sent. I, I was like, I, I can't forget about y'all, so I had to do this video. I haven't had energy to do any videos. I haven't had energy to do anything. I'm learning, though. I'm, I'm trying to, Chris, Christopher. Christopher, I'm trying. I just got to get, you know, it's a process. And right now I'm working on that process. But I'm finding that while I'm waiting for a load, I'm kind of lollygagging right now because what they're probably going to put me on is the same load that I've been getting going on. I'm going to Nacho Dolce's. Nacho, Nacho, Nacho Dolce's. <laughs> I call it Nachos. I'm going to Nachos usually. Puerto Rico, what up, trucker style? What up, Mark? So um, what I'll do is I'll probably leave at like midnight. And, uh, oh, excuse me. I'll leave at midnight, that's why I'm able to sit here and do this video with y'all. And then, um, my first stop, I'll get there like two hours, two and a half hours. My second stop probably won't open until 4 a.m., so I don't want to get there early. So that's why, um, thank you, Mark. So that's why I, um, I'm sitting here, I have a chance to maybe, I think that's what I'll start doing, is doing videos while I'm sitting waiting. Um, I'm glad to see you happy and not flipping out about not getting a load. That's the first time ever, I think. <laughs> I know, right? I know, right? Thank you, guys. <laughs> I'm happy. Um, I do about, thank you, James. I do three loads probably per day. It's three loads, well, three stops, one load. I haven't made it to two stops yet, or two loads yet. I, I haven't got there yet. Thank you, James. Um, is it a tow truck at the moment with my old truck on the back? Oh, wow. Sorry about that. Thank you, Angelo. What up, Jazzy? So, yeah. Um, that's what's going on with me. Hopefully, I'll find my footing and get a schedule down packed so I can start studying. I don't know how that's going to work. What I think I'm going to do is when I get off of work in the morning, I'll probably study before I go to sleep because um, I'm thinking of my days like this if I get off of work at 5 a.m. or 7 a.m. to me that's 7 p.m. I'm trying to flip it right I'm not sure about the pay yet last check was pretty good because it was all the extra stuff but tomorrow or tonight I'll know what my money will be looking like but I'm thinking so like thank you um, I'm thinking I'm trying I don't know why I keep I'm trying to adjust um, and think about it like my a.m. y'all a.m. like for everybody else in the world a.m. for me is p.m. so when I get off at 7 a.m. I'm really in my mind getting off at 7 p.m. so that means I'll go to bed at like 9 or 10 p.m. or a.m. p.m. in my mind a.m. for real for real and I'll sleep until 8 p.m. In real life but in my mind it's 8 a.m. that's how I'm thinking of it 
So if I think of it like that, when I get off of work at like 7 a.m. or 8 a.m., which in my mind is 7 p.m. or 8 p.m., I'll study for a couple of hours before I go to sleep, if I have enough energy. So we're working on the energy thing. You look so gorgeous and happy, so glad you're, all your plans are coming together. I'm about to go back over the road to the break during COVID-19. Thank you. I thought about I, I thought about going back over the road, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stick this out and see how it works. I'm going to see how it works out for me. Um, but yeah, so that's what's going on right now. It is a little bit after 11, and I am probably going to go in there and find out why they haven't called me yet, um, probably like around 1130, and we'll see what happens, but I'm, I'm happy, I like my new gig, my new digs, um, I think that I can I can do this I just got to figure out how I'm going to end up studying and actually putting that in play because that's that's the whole purpose right the whole purpose was to get home so I can study and have time to study so we'll see what, what how that works I might have to switch the day shift I don't want to do day shift but I might have to what's up hire gun it is different with a day cab. The turn radius is stupid, right? I wasn't going to abandon my load. I was just talking a lot of shit because I was mad. But, um, what up, lookout man? But the day cab is stupid, right? When I first drove it, we had to make a U-turn in the parking lot to park because they're teaching you how to, like, if you're, if you're parking off of the driver, off the passenger side, you make a U-turn, and then you set your truck up in a 90-degree angle, and then you back in. We don't have the fenders, it's a day cab, so it's not so long. So when I'm making a U-turn, I'm all nervous thinking I'm gonna fuck something up on the cab, but I'm not because I have a hella space. So it's really cool that I can make like different um, U-turns within like small spaces to maneuver and stuff. Because at the Walmarts, it, it's crazy. Um, and I had to take a nap the other day. I'm gonna show y'all something. I had to take a nap the other day. I was super sleepy, right? And I was tired, and I was so tired to where I needed to lay down. There was nowhere to lay down, so this is what I did. I put my feet over there, and I had my head right here, like right here, and I lay down on the floor. <laughs> I lay down on the floor. That's how tired I was. Um, and that, this was just last night, so I'm still just trying to, you know, get used to it. My daughter was like, what's the purpose of getting off, going, coming off the road if you're never going to be available? Like, when I come home, I go straight to sleep, and I wake up, and they're asleep. So, I'm still trying to get used to it. Um, I don't know, somebody told me, another driver told me it's going to take me like a month to get used to it. It's been a little bit over two weeks. It's been a little under two weeks, actually. So I'm trying. I don't know. Um, I'm just trying different things to see what works out for me. Um, like I said, by the time I get off of work, l lately I've been getting off of work around 10 and going to bed around noon. But the thing is, I need to be up by 8, 8 p.m. in order to get back to work at 9 30 10 o'clock i don't want to be here later than 9 30. so that means in reality i'm only getting eight hours of sleep and y'all know me i like to sleep i need 10 hours of sleep so i'm figuring if i get a get home and if i go to bed at noon that means i'm waking up at 10. that's not gonna work so i don't know i don't know i don't know i don't know um i need to go to bed at noon and be at home by at least 8 a.m so i can study so that's the, the, the structure I'm trying to work out. I do have the option to go day shift. I can work any shift if I want, but I don't know if I want to do day shift. 21 days of form happy. That's true. I'm I'm still trying to figure it out. I'm I'm grappling with it as far as day shift. Um, so if I did day shift, I would probably come in 
at like 6 a.m. and work until 6 p.m. But it's still gonna be the same thing, right? I'm still gonna have to go to bed at like 8 or 9 and be back up here at 6 a.m. And there's gonna be traffic and stuff like that. So, I don't know. Um, at first, when I first started, I started at midnight. I would come in at midnight and that was hard as fuck. I couldn't do it. Like after two days, I was like, I can't do midnight. Can I come in earlier? They was like, try 10. And I did 10. That was still too late. Another driver was like, try 9.30. I did 9.30 and then I started asking for long loads. And so um, then they told me to come in at 9. So I usually be here around between 9 and 9.30 and I usually get off between 7 and 8 a.m. Sometimes 9, sometimes 10. Just depends if I take a nap and if I log it yet. Um, what are y'all saying? Can I buy you dinner? Sure, Nicholas. You can go to um, Cash App, Dollface Trucker. It's a dollar sign, Dollface Trucker, all one word. And you can send money to buy dinner. That would be great. Dollface and Lookout Man Topics coming soon. You are very right. We are trying to work out a situation where we can go live together, but I've just been super tired. I'm, I'm definitely still wanting to do that Lookout Man. I just I need to get get on my shit. Seems like you might have more time doing OTR, but you would be away from family. Yeah, I, I like OTR, but yeah, I would be away from family, so I don't I don't think I want to do that right now. I'm really liking and enjoying my home time. I want to just get on a normal schedule. I want to get on a normal schedule. I want to get on a set schedule. I want to have a structure, and I want to have discipline, and I want to have a um, structure for my life so I can work on myself, work on my mental health, work on my emotional health, work on my physical health, work on school, work on studying. Le Leandria, so look, I'm going to call you because I was thinking about that too. You will be, you have to, whenever we go live, because some of the stuff that we're talking about, we might, we might have trolls, for real, for real. So I was thinking when I go live with Lookout Man, we'll be live on you on video so I'll be on video he'll be on video and I want to put you in there so you could be on video and you can help moderate the stuff so I'm gonna talk to lookout man about that but that and then you can also chime in stuff and stuff too um mental health is super important I feel you night driving seems better to me I would stay with the night shift I like night shift thank you Michael so yeah, I am just checking in with y'all. I spent the better part of 30 years. That's a good idea. That is a great idea. I spent the better part of 30 years running primarily nights. Almost four years ago, I took this day shift job. But it's still hard. I usually sleep for three or four hours a night. Oh man, hell no. I can't do three or four hours. I'm I'm really going to try to... Thank you, Jamos. I got it. I did. Thank you. Um, I am going to actually write down the whole schedule and have a planner. I'm going to go back to college days and have a whole planner of, like the planner, the way my planner is, like the one that I bought, it has times in 15 minute slots. So I'm going to like chunk out time in 15 minute slots for work, for sleep, for food, for studying, all of that. And, and everything else that I need to incorporate in my life because I'm serious about going to law school. Like I'm serious, serious. I need to do this. I really want to do this. Um, what flavor am I vaping? I am vaping Sour Sweet by Naked. Um, it it kind of reminds me of like gummy bears or something like that. And I mix it up with menthol. And then there's this another one by Naked called Brain Freeze. I like that one too. I don't want to get my own authority. I want to go to law school. Thank you, Nadine. So yeah, I'm about to go. Um, I just wanted to check in with y'all real quick. What up, Brandon? And let y'all know that I didn't forget about you. I'm just really trying to adjust to working overnight and having enough time and energy to do videos. But what I think I'm gonna do is when I come into work, I'm thinking about um, doing videos while I'm waiting for my load. So that's what I'm thinking about doing. How long of school do you have left? Well, I have to still, uh, I have to um, enroll in law school. Law school is three years. I've already done my undergrad, but um, law school is three years. 
so yeah that's what I think I'm gonna do so if you when I do videos it'll probably be between 9 and 10 o'clock at night and around this time or later I mean between 9 and 11 o'clock at night um, while I'm waiting for a load that's what I think that I'll do so it'll be a little bit easier for me to to you know go live with you as far as me and lookout man I haven't figured that out yet because I want to actually do it the right way and I don't want to be lollygagging with that so um, I just I'm off on Mondays and Tuesdays but yeah that's a whole nother story but um, I'm gonna let y'all go I just want to make this really quick and check in with y'all and let y'all know how everything is going um, and tell y'all what was going on with me I, I want to go I want to keep going live again I don't want you guys to forget about me I didn't forget about y'all I just have to get used to this schedule okay so I want all y'all to be safe have fun do what y'all do I'm about to go in there and check in and I'll talk to y'all later um, thank you lookout man thank you Brandon and I'll check in with y'all again soon, okay? Talk to y'all later. Bye.